Hello, my name is Dr. Ilona Schneider. I'm working at Eden Technologies in Langlohnsheim in Germany. I'm responsible for the product beverage treatments and the R&D, and from the professionals, I'm an allergist. Today we are talking about wine enzyme. First of all, it will be clarification enzyme. The other one would be extraction enzyme. And we will look how does an enzyme work and what is the meaning behind it. First of all, we are talking about clarification enzyme. Clarification enzymes are pectolytical enzymes by meaning they are degradating the pectin chain. How does a pectin chain look like? You can see here on the slide, there is a pectin chain and the enzyme is degradating this chain to smaller particles. And now the question is how to use a granulated enzyme in a winery. Here you can see how a granulated enzyme looks like. It's a white powder, as you can see here on the spoon, and you can use it in a winery pretty easy. You take 200 milliliter in this case of water. Here we have approximately 10 gram enzyme in. We pour it in, and then we dissolve it in water. The dissolving process does not take too long, and now the enzyme is ready to use. To test the clarification enzyme, we use normally the pectin test. And therefore, we take 5 milliliters of juice from the clarified part of the juice, and we put it in a tube. And further on, we take 5 milliliters of ethanol, and therefore, making this also in the tube. And the only thing you have now to do is mixing. So that's pretty easy. So you pour it up and down, and then it's finished. We make the same with the unclarified juice, or the natural clarified juice, without any enzyme, 5 milliliters of juice, and 5 milliliters of ethanol. And again, we make a small mixing, and then the reaction can start. So we mix also this tube. So this reaction of the two tubes, you can see here on the left side, we have with enzyme. On the right hand side, we have without any enzyme. And it takes now two minutes. And then we have to wait, and then the reaction will work out. Two minutes afterwards, you can see the reaction of the pectin test by meaning on the left-hand side, there is a clarified juice. There is no turbidity. The tube is completely clear. On the right-hand side, you can see there's turbidity in. There was uh, some bubbles in, and the reaction was clearly that the pectin is not completely degraded. And this is now the easiest part of a, for a winemaker to control uh, the clarification enzyme and how to work with the clarification enzyme. The exact description of a pectin test you can see here on the slide. You take 5 milliliters of juice and 5 milliliters of 96% ethanol. You mix it as you have seen it before. And this is the easiest way and the easier tool to make a really a test of clarification enzyme and the clarification process. The next step where to use an uh, enzyme in a winery is during mashing. And therefore, we have prepared two different parts. One is a wet grape mash without an enzyme. And here, this is with an enzyme. And now you can easily control that by using a drop test. That means we take uh, some filter paper, like you see here on the top, and we pour more or less the liquid fraction of the grape mash into and over the filter. This is seen here as a demonstration. We are doing the same now with the glass where the mesh is in with the enzyme. And again, we pour only the liquid fraction over the filter. And now it takes a couple of minutes, and you will see the result and the difference between the mesh treated with an enzyme and the mesh treated without any enzyme. The result of the drop test is, can be seen here. 
in the trial where we have no enzyme, there is only small liquid, only a small fraction and volume of juice, free one juice. On the other hand, with enzyme, we have a much higher volume, much higher free one juice. The color is much brilliant and it's really a dark color. So that's the most best benefit of an extraction enzyme. That was the session about wine enzyme. First of all, we heard something about clarification enzyme, and then the second part was about extraction enzyme. Thanks a lot for your attention, and see you soon.